the temperature. You can keep it cool while playing beach volleyball in Arizona thanks to a first of its kind indoor beach volleyball facility it's over in Peoria. That's where we find Team 12's Monica Garcia this morning. Getting a little sweaty spiking at the net there, Monica. We were impressed at your vertical leap. Oh, I don't sweat, I glisten. Okay, Paul, just, just so you know. <laughs> If you want a, a fun place, and like Emma said, where you're not going to be sweating outside, it's not going to be super hot, you can take your kids here, and it still feels like you're outside. The coolest thing is I have my toes in the sand. This is California sand, guys, shipped in from California. Now, this is Beach House Volleyball. So these are the owners here. They are former pro volleyball stars. I threw the stars in there because they're really nice. Former pro, pro volleyball players. They're playing uh, beach tennis right now because that's what you can also do if you want to take a break from the actual volleyball that's going on. Brad, I'm going to interrupt you. Now, this is something I can play. Why did you not give me the paddle to start with? It's a great game for just about <laughs> anybody, especially a lot of you paddle ballers out there. Get out on the nice, deep, soft sand where there's uh, no impact at all. I think Paul Gerke is big into paddle ball. Yeah, there's a, there's a, a lot of great uh, paddle ball or pickleball players out there. A lot of fun. Okay, so what makes this place so special? I know this is w the only one in the state. Correct. Yep, we are the first and only uh, indoor beach volleyball facility. We imported all of our sand from California uh, to make it a true beach volleyball experience. Now, why California sand? And I thought this was something interesting that you mentioned to me because if you use Arizona sand, what goes on? Uh, Arizona gets hard packed. There's a lot of dirt in it, so it gets hard packed. You heard your causes a lot of injuries. Yes. Okay, exactly. so if you, uh, maybe you, your kids want to come out and play volleyball, you guys are at the competitive level, but then it's also the fun level for average Joes like me. So I'm going to have you follow me. Brad, don't you leave me. Okay, we're going to head over here. Uh, these folks, hey guys, how are you? Wake up early on the reg, right? And come out here and play volleyball. I'm just gonna like wander into their game. Okay, I'm gonna show you just how, <laughs> I see these balls go around, uh, how easy it can be. I'm gonna hand the mic to Chris. So really quickly, if people wanna come out, it's Beach House Volleyball, where can they find you? Um, you can find us on, uh, just Google beachhousevolleyball.com and um, we have our Facebook page, Beach House Volleyball. We list a lot of our leagues, our recreational leagues. And it's fun, tell them how oh, fun it is. It's so fun, it's a great workout, it's fun. You have fun while you're working out, you know. And you can burn 800 calories. All right, here we go, okay, hold this. I'm getting the rep, I'm getting it the is rep. A All right guys, we're gonna play. Workout. They're like, who are you, crazy Not running in the sand. Not if you're bad at it. If you just okay. stand still, you, you won't burn very much at all. When you're stationary. There you go. Yes. Yes. Come on, Monica. Monica. Go get get it. It. Come on, Monica. Get in. Oh. Okay. She pushed. Valiant effort. Don't quit yeah. your day job, though, Monica. Not exactly a set and also totally against the okay, rules, but she looked good. <laughs> 800 calories. I'm about